What's going on, you guys? Yeah. Everyone grab their pink comforter. I got the worst haircut ever. This is my haircut. Look at that. Oh, and you and then you said Pat Dixon does have a past. He's afraid to his chin is kind of neato. He's Ray DeVito. He is a Guido. He's not a pedo. His name is Ray DeVito. Problems with his pedo. He's kind of retardito. His Ray DeVito. His chin is pretty neato. That Ray DeVito. Your information he'll repeat. That stinky Guido. That's Ray DeVito. Rock bottom podcast starts now. What's up? How are you guys? What's going on? Minji Co, your mic is muted. It's like really loud because I'm making coffee. Oh, you're making coffee? Okay, all right. When your coffee's done. It's eight o'clock in the morning where she's at, so it's great. Quadfather. It's eleven o'clock in the eleven thirty in the morning. Eleven thirty in the morning. All right, that's still morning. That's when I'll probably wake up tomorrow. They're like, so it's ten thirty here. So they're literally like on the other side of the hour. world. Yeah, yeah, that's on the other side of the world. <laughs> the I am the on the side. other side of the world. The How other are you, Quadfather? Good to meet you. Oh, yeah, awesome. Good to meet you too. World. Right. I feel like singing Aladdin. A whole new world. The other side of the world. A whole um, new world. If My we uh, started one. digging a hole straight through the earth, we'd end up over where she's at, right? One hour difference. One hour difference. It's uh, Maybe. I don't know. But like definitely on the other side of the world. Where are you based How at, my father? Oregon. Oregon. Just north of California. Everyone knows where California's at, so. I know Oregon. Oh, okay. How do you know Oregon? You've been to Oregon? I haven't been there, but I know of it. You you saw it on a map? Uh, I think so. How but, are uh, you today, Minji? What's going on? You just woke up. You're ready to I go. I am so hungover. What happened? <laughs> no, like I got drunk last night. I'm, um, I'm gonna drink a beer. I'm gonna cheers. I'm gonna do thirty days sober. That's what I'm going to do. Like starting tomorrow? Yeah, not today. I'm in Cleveland, and they had the Cleveland Comedy Festival or the Cleveland Comedy Awards things yesterday. Mm. Um, I wasn't nominated. They, they don't think I'm in Cleveland. They think I'm like a New York comic. But uh, I hung out with a bunch of Cleveland comics, and then uh, tonight I did a show, and it was great. A lot of people like um, – know me from online that was nice so it was nice it was nice i did a show tonight i did a bunch of new jokes a bunch of old jokes it was fun i had good times um how are you minji how'd you how'd you feel about mlc tell me about that <laughs> uh i had fun it was like i did it like really early in the morning which is like six in the morning six to eight in the in the morning and then I just like slept through right after. Um, yeah, I had fun. I thought you were great. I thought you were great on it. I like how you initially, like, all they do is shit on me. <laughs> 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 they hate you. <laughs> yeah, they hate me. Yeah, they hate me. Yes, they hate me. I try to defend you. I, no, I it's do, fine. I did. Like, I'm like, I, I really do find you funny. And, um, yeah. Like, uh, do you realize I, three I, weeks ago, <laughs> three weeks ago, I was best friends. I was best friends with him. I was best friends with him. And then like, uh, yeah, I best I friends. Agreed. Like how you guys went for walks in the park and shared ice cream. No, and, he's what? a good guy. I still, I still like Kevin, but yeah, I, yeah, that was it. We were hanging out, um, Super Bowl weekend. He signed off on me going to Vegas, signed off on Pat Dixon going to Vegas. He was like, ah, oh, the they're making a little play about it. Like, yeah, this is Ray's first time on an airplane. It's going to be fun. And then, like, all of a sudden he got mad. And it was like, they already paid for the flight. They pay for the hotel. I'm getting paid to do a podcast out there, getting paid to do stand-up comedy out there. And so 
I, I can't cancel gigs because someone else wants me to cancel. So uh, I will always respect Kevin Brennan, thankful, and I'll go back when they want me to go back if uh, they want me to go back. But in the meantime, like, I can't. I, like, I just. I don't think they will. <laughs> They'll have you back. They're just not going to pay you. Maybe they'll do that. They'll just let you be a guest. Unpaid. Yeah, I could be an unpaid guest. What's up, Carlos Danger? Hi, Carlos, Carlos Danger, you joining this or not? Is this like a summit? What's going on right now? Oh, I don't God. know. I don't know what Carlos Danger is doing. He showed up on my screen. He's uh, He's a friend of mine. Everyone, and by the way, I also want to say this. Thank you to everyone that Venmoed me. You can Venmo me at uh, Ray Dash DeVito. Um, but yeah, like some MLC fans were like, hey, man, you, you got a raw deal. You and Patrick Dixon got a raw deal and like have Venmoed me since then. I appreciate it. Like I said, I'll always be an MLC ambassador, but yeah, it is what it is. It's like just. It's like, I just, can we all just be friends? What is this? We're just all in the podcasting game. Everyone be friendly. I um, was surprised at the money. Like, just a lot of money happening there. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. And yeah. Um, I, <laughs> I think I made a mistake once. Um, I revealed some of my relationship history. And I'm like, I, I'm not going to you know what? Cause we were talking on Instagram chat and I sent you a chat and I go, you don't have to say his name. I'm like, just don't confirm or deny it. I you wasn't said his first name. And then it was like, if they show the picture, I'm like, don't confirm or deny it. Like that could be I mean, the guy. I, I didn't really, I, I wasn't really checking my like, instagram chat while on podcast because i wanted to be like you know like focused <laughs> but like you know i was just like a little like asian girl in the jungle not knowing the rules the little asian I'm girl right. in the jungle that's the name of this episode little asian girl in the jungle, jungle book <laughs> little asian call this girl. episode jungle yeah. book adam uh, heck yeah um quag father have you, you been to nlc yeah yeah i've been on there a few times um did you get the two hundred dollars, or did Kevin yes, pocket that? Of course, she did. No, no, he, she definitely did. I mean, like yeah, not yeah. that. I didn't really get like that comment money, but um, yeah, that's what I was talking about. Uh, no, I didn't get that money. See, no, you it's, gotta it's get. All right. You no, should all be right, getting right. paid to tell your secrets. Not Kevin gets paid to tell no. your secrets. That's not how this works, no, Kevin. Come so. on, man. <laughs> No, it's it's all good. Like um, he pulled a fast one on you. But I, in general, I had fun. I feel like um, I got to know more people. This, you know, it's, and you then told... oh my god, like Sarah Silverman lost virginity to Kevin. Yeah, yeah. And like she has a freaking like sound bite. <laughs> There's a sound bite of it. <laughs> what is this world? I told you, like, you said at the beginning, you go, uh, this is Carlos Danger. What's up, Carlos? Carlos, you coming in or not coming in? What are you doing? <laughs> Carlos is oh, like, no, kind he's of trolling you guy. again. No, he said he was coming in. He's trying to work on stuff. Carlos is trying to help my podcast. I have a, I have a good friend, Carlos Danger, who sometimes he likes me. Sometimes he tries to sabotage me, but he's overall, he's a good egg. He's a. Uh, He's a good. No, I'm glad you had fun. Like it, it is fun, and yeah, yeah, and I, I think you did great. But you did say to me, like, that it is like a little weird that you felt like the whole podcast is them like trying to trick you into saying something that you didn't want to say. <laughs> like that's like kind of the theme of it. I think they were trying to like get me hate you. <laughs> that's yeah. W welcome, yeah. It's, but like, um, I don't hate you. Yeah, I, uh, there's yeah. yes. I, I, You're the only one left, Minji. Oh my god! Everybody else hates everyone else. Everyone else hates Ray. Well, he's oh, who hates me, Quad Father. <laughs> like everyone. Jesus, is... look, look at your chat sometime, and, and you tell no, me. No, I don't get. But they're not people that are guests on my shows. Like, 
Like Tracy Jane is still a good friend of mine that does it all the time. She met Elise. Minji met Elise. Elise does my podcast a bunch. She's a lady that's on my mm-hmm. podcast. Tracy Carnazzo. Like, yeah, the only lady that doesn't like me would be Ari Jane. And we all know that history. That's I have reason to not like that lady. So but yeah, like come everyone on, Ray, else. Relax, like, no, buddy. Fine. I'm the fucking rock bottom podcast ambassador. I go oh. around saying good things about your podcast everywhere. Yes. I might be the only one. Yeah. No, we got people. We got Detroit Dabblers in here. He says, Ray, did you call a little girl sexy? Pedo alert. I. Yes, I called him. M- Minji's good. Look, stop it. Everyone knows Minji's hot. Everyone knows. Quadfather, you think Minji's hot? I think Minji's hot. Yeah, of course. Let's watch more of her videos. That's what we got to do. Just get her in here and just show more and more of her videos. Oh of her dancing sexy. Everyone likes it. Yeah, you dance sexy and we'll make uh, painting materials. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> Please, just, uh, more inspo, the better. Yeah, we just need to know where to send it. That's all. <laughs> yeah, I, I think got, you got a cum drive. A cum drive? A cum drive? Yeah. yeah. How are you feeling about you're going back to New York City? You ex- you excited? I'm so excited, dude. Like I got like one week left until my flying plate and takes off. Um yeah, I'm excited to do the like um you know, get back connected, reconnect with my old friends, do crazy like open mics. Uh it's gonna be fun. I like it. And then I I also enjoy I'm excited to go to the office actually, like to for work. So right. that's always exciting too. They're like, here comes come in the city. Here she is. Here's come in the city. <laughs> no, get, her in get her in here. Come in the city. Get her in here. Everyone's like, yay. <laughs> They're gonna bring out their art canvases, like, here we go. Oh I my made God. this for you, Minji. <laughs> I mean, I I'm excited for um this person um that i like up <laughs> and yeah i like there you go. so you already got dudes lined up you have a guy i don't know i don't know where this is going it's been like a very like a long um you know on and off kind of situation i'm surprised we're still in touch um is so he the yeah. guy you mentioned on mlc or a different guy this is a different person. I mean, okay. the person that, um, that I mentioned on MLC, he and I, we we just we're like, we just three dates, not not a lot, just like just not deep. Just we, I don't know right. how, how how his name was mentioned. No, I know you exactly said his name. Yeah, I was gonna say I know, say, I know how it was mentioned. I know exactly <laughs> why. I think I know how the name was mentioned. I think I know the exact uh, reason for that super is, chat. Is <laughs> the you new guy a comedian? You I am not telling you. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Do you have a, Come on, <laughs> someone send in two hundred bucks. Let's get this out of here. Uh, huh? Yes. Send in two hundred dollars. Super chat two hundred bucks. Let's get oh, this yeah. info get, out of her. Get that money to me in my pocket. This time. Right? Yeah. This time. Ray, how was Panera and Planet Fitness? Busy day. Now beers. Uh, I I did not go to Planet Fitness today. I went to the rec center today. Uh, but yes, I went to Panera to have a coffee. But thank you, buddy. Quad. Who's a better comic, Stuttering John or Ray? I, Stuttering I, John. His stutter Clip John it. doesn't do comedy. Yeah, yeah. Cliff. Yeah, yeah. yeah. St- uh, Stuttering John was this guy from Howard. Stern. He doesn't do comedy. He was like a, a famous guy in the nineties. Mm. He yeah, he's not a comedian. Uh, Quadfather's. He dabbles in comedy. Come on, yeah, yeah. give him a little credit. I uh, yeah, I've had I had two comedy specials last year. For Christ's sake, I mean, I know Jared Carmichael, but. <laughs> I was on Stuttering John's show earlier today. I think you were there. You saw. Jesus, Leo Gunn. This is one of my good friends. Don't worry, Minji. We hate right here, too. So God. your friends just send you money to talk to you. That's what's going on. Yeah, they're not nice to me. This is Leo Gunn. He's a good friend of mine. I hope you get gout twice as bad as you had it yesterday, Leo Gunn, with these comments like that. <laughs> yeah, he's being mean. You guys, uh. 
you got he's a fellow gout sufferer such as yourself yeah he had a gout outbreak earlier uh this week mariana how much back child support does quad father owe quad daughter um yeah, this is welcome millions, to millions of dollars. Million, million, I mean, it's so dollars. much. I'll One never pay it back. Million dollars. Uh, misery loves onion. First time flying. How did you get to Vegas? For I flew. That was the whole gag on MLC. It was a, that was the whole that that was the whole fucking misery loves onions. So how'd you meet this guy uh, that you're going to hang out with? <laughs> tell you <laughs> is he also a comic i am not telling you <laughs> no that's uh, a requirement not, not, of not. every podcast is you have to answer every question it's mandatory in fact fuck you <laughs> yeah i don't i don't want to know his fuck name you, quad father where is your quad daughter yeah where's your quad daughter where's your quad daughter you fucking quad father it, wouldn't quad that be a, daughter. i mean can you imagine like a dad and a daughter coming down the sidewalk both in like a one big wheelchair with the dad and, and one, one in little a tiny little wheelchair, wheelchair. a big <laughs> wheelchair that's like that motorcycle when they have a little sidecar like you're in, your big, yeah. you're in your big wheelchair she's in a little wheelchair next to you minji it he, would it, it wouldn't work too well for going through doors, but the sidecar, uh, that does sound like, or maybe a trailer, a trailer with a kid. By the way, Minji, Quadfather's not like, a comedian. Oh, where's the kid go? He's not a comedian. He's just a yeah, podcaster. Yeah, who are you, Quadfather? He's, he's got a podcast called the uh, Backyard Boys Podcast, and mm. uh, he got paralyzed years ago when mm. he was drunk and he jumped off uh, a out of a tree into a swimming pool and broke his neck. And now he can't, now he's a uh, paraplegic. Now I can't make jokes. I'm not funny anymore. It, it ruined my sense of humor. But you were never <laughs> a stand-up comedian. The I mean, you can never And I'm really not a stand-up comedian now, am I? You can't stand up at all. <laughs> I'm sorry. But he's a podcaster, yes. <laughs> Wait, have you tried stand-up? Okay. Have you tried standing yeah, up? Stand That's up. where we got to start. Have yeah, you I'm tried to... standing up? Maybe you can I do it. I dabble in standing up. <laughs> Maybe you can do it. And you're just not like, you can do I'm it. Just lazy. I'm just lazy. That's all there <laughs> yeah, is to it. Yeah. You need to try, dude. It's good. What do you think? Do you think he's faking? Yeah, I, never, I never even thought of that. Like, after I broke my neck, I was like, I never even thought to try to stand up. What a What a novel concept. Yeah, you know. Like what do you a, think, Minji? Is he oh. is he is he faking, Minji? You gimmick. <laughs> He's a gimmick. You think he can make it? You're a gimmick, Will Taylor. Um, yeah. I wouldn't be the first one there. Did you ever see the guy that uh, he pretended to be in a wheelchair for years on a live stream, and then one I day do. he accidentally stood up right in front of the camera? <laughs> Get out of here! He, Stop this! No, this is fact. I'll have Who to. Is I'll this? look it up for you. I don't even know the guy's name. Maybe someone in the chat will know it, but oh yeah, it's a hundred percent happened. It was oh, it's insane. God. He had a big following, a huge podcast, and uh, one day he accidentally just stood up. He like accidentally wasn't thinking. stood up. Yeah, like didn't turn his camera off or something, and messed up and stood up, and everyone saw it. And then he tried to like play it off like it didn't happen. Uh, but so, <laughs> that was a miracle. Like bye. Yeah. It's a miracle. It's a miracle. That's um, um that's a cold. But sorry for that incident though. I, I mean accident. Um but it's all on you, so you can't it's blame all anyone. On you. <laughs> yeah, it's no one you. made him. It's you getting drunk. I blame I, me. I did it. I mean, I recently hurt my ligament. Yes, um, you could tell them how you identify Minji. Tell them how it's the exact same thing. Just not <laughs> being able to use your legs. Oh, that's like, close, I, I'm sure. I mean, it's like, the exact um, same thing. <laughs> no, like it's been it's been rough. I mean, like not to brag um, in front of you. It's been rough. Like um, I, uh, my knee knee ligament hurt. Uh, I hurt my knee ligament, and then that's been about like three month i was like kind of limping and stuff and then um that was it ha happened in like a dance class i was taking a vogue class and then i like like stripper uh, dancing no it's like a voguing do you know like a like i was on the floor madonna? And I, like madonna I ended wrong but like it's just like a just like a split moment of something and then it's just you know like it leaves mark and i feel bad 
got it. Great for this. <laughs> you can totally identify with him. That's totally good. <laughs> like this one time I sprained my wrist and I couldn't move my hand for like three days. So I totally get it. I totally get what it's like <laughs> no, being it's paralyzed. A moment. I, I totally get what so we're... No, I feel bad for you guys. I really do. <laughs> yeah. I have a lot of sympathy for this you. One time I had a hangnail. I like bit my nail and like I had a hangnail and it wouldn't stop bleeding. I totally get it, dude. Uh, totally, why did like, I do that? <laughs> I, it's, Wait, totally, it's totally like not being able to move your legs. I totally get it. I, yeah, it's totally. It's, it's probably worse, really. <laughs> First time flying. How did you get to Vegas? Yes, I've flown on a plane before. That was the whole fucking thing we were talking about. Misery loves onions. But thank you. Johnny Payton, Ray, you need government cheese like Quad. You're more dis. I'm more disabled. They're saying I'm more disabled than Quad, so I get government cheese. By the way, cheese isn't that healthy for you. So government is like the food they give you is cheese. It's always like a thing. Government cheese, but like you it's think it's generic. More... Yep. Ray hates cheap food. Yeah, man. I uh, yeah, we went through cheese wasn't cool with. We did. I like yeah. how like that was like a thing. Like you love Panera bread. Yeah, I yes, I've eaten Panera bread quite a bit. Uh, but yes, there's. But I hear no guy Ray a squatter in the back room of a Planet Fitness. Yes, I live in a Planet Fitness. That's where I. That's where I apparently live. I mean, that does kind of track with the. Uh with with what's the machine called behind you uh, treadmill. treadmill yeah yeah i mean that could be I, just a back room at a planet fitness absolutely have you been lying to us yes i i live in a planet fitness I that's who was yeah. telling you to be quiet that one night was like the manager he's like all right we're shutting down you gotta be quiet now don't let anyone know you're in here yes i'm clearly in a planet fitness that's what i'm doing um but thank you. No. Have you had any problem with the uh, young Ruscallians lately at the Planet Fitness? Hanging out, smoking weed? No, that's only in New York City, which I don't get why they don't kick them out in uh, New York City. A bunch of kids like hang out in the locker room. Mm. Uh, and the Planet, like, Minji, when you're in New York City, do you go to the gym or anything? I, I used to go to um, Pilates. Um, oh, Pilates. I, I'm not uh, really a gym girl. Like, I don't find gym fun. fun. What's your exercise? What do you like to do for exercise? Besides dance sexually, which we've seen. Um, yoga, Pilates. Um, I don't like going to the gym. It's just boring. Would it be yeah, rude I, to I ask if you do karate? So. Hmm? Karate? <laughs> I, ask, at least ask me a proper question. Ask me yeah, about I, come on, right? I said, would it be rude to ask you if you did karate? Come on. <laughs> no, 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 I can assume. Yeah. Right. No, um, I never tried karate. I tried taekwondo though. I was like something belt, not black belt. Though. A green. You should hey, practice you're like, your nunchucks. Like... Practice uh... your nunchucks in case you see the really tall redhead in New York City. Uncle Stokes, <laughs> you thank you, buddy. <laughs> Have a good night, Ray. Go tribe. Yeah, the tribe's playing. I did play in your Oakland A's tonight. It's uh, start time just just a half an hour ago. I don't know what the tribe's going to do this year. I don't think they're going to do that great, but I root for them. I'm from Cleveland. That's my baseball team. Cleveland Guardians. Used to be the Cleveland Indians. Uh, Peter Chicken Man Brennan, who's a good egg. Minji, Bobby Lee hates Ray too. Bobby is greater than Jolie. Actually, I'm uh, I'm okay friends. Bless you. I'm actually okay friends with Bobby Lee the few times I've met him. I don't know him that well, but... Uh, yeah. Oh, uh, Korean comics really look up to him. It's like, yeah, it's Bobby Lee's. I find him really cool too. He, he's a really nice guy. I'm, yeah. I'm fine with Bobby Lee. Like Bobby Lee and I are like, uh, um, we're fine. He doesn't know me that well. I we only know each other in passing. He's done my show at the stand before. Oh, Very nice. funny comic. He's a, uh, I like him and I uh, like his podcast when I listen to it. Tiger Belly. What yeah. do you guys think about Joe Coy? I like him. I, I, I felt bad I, for him. I don't. I don't know him. I never. I never met him. Uh, I don't know him in any capacity. Like uh, I, I know he's out there doing his thing. I'm. Not, I'm not too much into his comedy, but th then again, like uh, that's fine. It's. I mean, you know? I think. I think his like mom 
bit is so funny like um just from asian perspective it's just like something that i feel like i should try because my parents are funny and then i yeah like some, i i want to learn comedy from him <clears throat> yeah so he was always hilarious like... on like uh adam carolla show i don't know if you guys saw his bits he used to come on there quite a bit but his last special i mean that's fucking hilarious the one uh in hawaii i believe he was in hawaii Mm, that's also cool too because there's a lot of like big asian population in hawaii so i think it could be very relevant i just felt right. bad for the his performance at the um what, what was the award show the academy awards yeah the academy i felt well, bad. That, that was a tough gig for any comic to take that after what just happened to chris rock like mm -hmm. it was a no-win situation anyone that took that gig was like kind of fucked yeah you, yeah. you know what well, i mean it was like already like all right, so we don't appreciate Chris Rock, who's like, I think the greatest comic of all time. Mm. Uh, I mean, but Chris Rock, go watch his specials. He's, I, I think he's the best. Like, Bigger and Blacker, uh, Bring the Pain, are like two of the greatest comedy specials ever. Like, Chris Rock is the first one to be in, like, all right, you don't got to do, like, just hokey jokes. You can talk about relevant shit going on from, uh, like, Bring the Pain, like, stuff in society that was going on, like the O.J. Simpson thing. Mm. Where, um, you know, like, um, like who's more racist, black people or white people? Black people, because we hate black people too. And I'm not going to the rest of his bits, but you know, like, yeah. it's a little bit yeah, too yeah, racy yeah. for me. He says the yeah. n word. That's unacceptable. <laughs> yeah. But he's, um... he's like, they always say Martin Luther King's the most peaceful guy ever. Go anywhere in America. There's more violence going on at Martin Luther King Boulevard King than Bull anywhere. If you're ever That's at Martin, Luther, if you're ever at Martin Luther, <laughs> that is Luther true. Boule Boulevard, run, run. The media's there. The media's there. It couldn't, <laughs> it couldn't be any one of the. Like, it's still relevant. Like that joke is like 30 years old, and we're all mm -hmm. laughing at it. We still get it. Like it's the media. It's not us. The media. Run, run. The media's are MLK Boulevard. Run, run. The media's there. The media's there. Yeah. So yeah, Chris Rock's a goat. Yeah. Like, uh, and even the way he handled the Will Smith thing, like in his special, like I got slapped by the softest rapper to ever exist. <laughs> like, the, like I didn't even, not even a hardcore rapper, like fucking the Fresh Prince. Like, yeah. yeah. As far as we know, who knows what he was doing behind the scenes, right? No, he Chris could have been Rock running one of the most deadliest gangs in America for all we know. No, Chris mm. Rock's a goat of comedy. I'm, I'm sorry. Like, no, yeah, Will Smith. He's... You're saying he's soft. I'm saying maybe he wasn't. Maybe there's things we don't know about the guy. No, Will Smith. Like, I, I kind of great actor, but like, even he when tried his... comedy? what's up? Has, has he done comedy? Like, I, I know he's in comedy movie, but like, stand up. Has he tried stand up? He did a thing, and here's what's also weird. Like, he did do a stand up series. Where it, on Netflix, where it was like Will Smith yeah. presents com comics, like uh, Sam, T my buddies uh, Sam Talent and uh, and also Sean Patton were on that thing, and it's weird because like you you weren't allowed to make fun of Will Smith. You almost had to be like the whole thing is like being congratulatory towards him. Uh, they took it off because um, this came out like a few months. Um, before the Oscars thing happened, but they took it off Netflix after the whole thing. Damn. Like uh, uh, after the whole like, like, but it was weird. It was weird. Why? Because I watched a couple episodes, and it's like you can't even make fun of Will Smith. You had to like, they're like congratulating him We're with the... jokes, and it's like that doesn't work. That's not comedy. Mm. Like you got to shit on someone if you're gonna make jokes. You can't so, like be like ask somebody, I see. You can't like make them all. You have so much money, you can do this, this, and that. Ha ha ha! It's like, it's that's not funny. But um, yeah. I mean, like we met at a roast battle, so it was. I mean, roasting is a specific form of comedy, right? I, I yes, roasting is a form of uh, comedy. I uh, and cooking. You called copper tone little baby sexy. I think that's, uh, I thought the ad was inappropriate. Did you ever see this, Minji? Not to like. Oh, we're going to, uh, we have to do this again. Oh, Lord. 
So there's a suntan lotion company. And no, they... let me set this. Let me set this up. The other night we were talking. To, I asked. I asked Ray. I was like, "Don't you think it's hot when chicks have a really good tan and then like they have a two piece bikini on and uh, you know it shows the tan lines? Tan lines uh, are hot on a lady. Yeah, it's well tanned." Uh, we went from that conversation to this. Go ahead, well, Ray. Well, well th this was an ad. This is like the biggest suntan lotion company in America, and it's like a it's like a infant with tan lines. And I was like, that's not infant with like, it's like thick thighs. <laughs> yeah, we don't need like sex. Yeah, we don't need sexy babies in this in this thing. Yeah, that's all I was saying. Yeah, we don't need sexy babies, right? Babies I, uh, are adorable. They're supposed to be chubby, and you tickle them, and you have fun with babies. You don't, you don't look at babies like, whoa, that baby's got some sexy tan line. It's just a <laughs> weird fucking thing that they have. I also that's all saw I was like a very old um, painting, <clears throat> oh. and that it was <clears throat> a girl, like a little baby, little baby girl, like posing like a sexy nude model and then a guy was a little boy was painting her it was like a whole painting it was disgusting that's insane so wait a minute a little boy i i think we're gonna get this channel shut down just talking about this so a little boy was painting like a little girl not and doing one of your arts naked. I, I want, I want that little girl was half naked. I want to find that picture. No, screen. no, don't put that up, please. Don't put that. Oh my god. Okay. Yeah. It's like <laughs> yeah, a no. painting, though. Okay. We're all gonna get arrested. The second you get off at JFK, the second you get playing, aren't you that no. lady? That I'm that just thinking it's wrong. <laughs> yeah, it but is wrong. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was, very, it was very wrong, but like it was like up on the wall of a like museum in Philadelphia or something like. Or San Francisco, somewhere. Yeah. No one weird too. Up. Like they it's celebrated it. It's it was on the wall of a freaking museum. Wow. How, on it. Did you see it or you just saw it like on a website? No, I saw it. I saw it on the it, when I went to when I went to visit a museum. It's like it was so wrong and I was like so surprised that no one made comments, like a claim. And you make makes complaints, you know? Mixed but compliments. Like, <laughs> I'm calling no, this complaint, episode mixed complaints. Complaint. <laughs> <laughs> like that's a great painting. No, like uh it was a terrible painting. I yeah. Minji, you know Ray never gets any girls, right? Hashtag bone dry. No, you hung out with that um trans lady. Oh yeah. <laughs> Yes, I, I I do create in the trans community. It's uh, clearly, clearly what I do. Uh, clearly, that's that's your thing. That's that's my wheelhouse. Yeah, were you <laughs> were you surprised to find a tra a, a tranny on uh, on Grinder like that? <laughs> no, that was that, that was on Bumble. That was on Bumble. <laughs> uh, I had no idea she was trans until she let me know, and I was like, all right. But yes, no, there was a quite elaborate. What makes SJ better comic than Ray? All right, Hoagie boy. Uh, stage presence, uh, this this great stories he's got. Um, yeah, timing, oh, he, he, delivery, uh, it, the whole stuttering John is the whole package of comedy. All right, Come on. All right, all right. whatever. Stutter John has never done stand up comedy. Not that I care. They're trying to get he like he stands up on a stage and makes jokes, tells stories. Come on, that's a stand up. Hell yeah, man! Hell yeah, he's uh, definitely uh, a stand up. So, who's this guy you're gonna meet when you get back to the states? Now I'm a shut up. <laughs> Read another chat. <laughs> no, I learned my lesson. I'm no, not. I, I don't want to know his name. I don't want to know his name at all. But like. <laughs> So you're conversing back and forth with the guy? I'm, I am conversing. I mean, like, not so much because, like, we were, like, at some point we were so toxic. Like, I 
you know, like when you become, when you realize that you become a very toxic person around a very certain person, and then that person becomes toxic to you back. So it was at that situation. So we like, because, and then. Toxic like what? Herpes or what? I definitely have herpes, but. Do you really have herpes? I have herpes. You don't have herpes, you losers. <laughs> Are you talking you about HPV or herpes? herpes? Wait a minute. You really have herpes, herpes or HPV? Because everyone has HPV. Herpes. I have herpes. <laughs> she looks at it like what? You know what? <laughs> yeah. No wonder why no dude in Korea. Is I don't like, know. Ah. <laughs> I mean, Minji, no offense, you're hot. And I would, uh, yeah, obviously. I mean, first Doesn't of all, that I mean, make me hotter that I have herpes. No. <laughs> no. The gift that keeps on giving no. for a lifetime. Huh? Uh, yeah, like I just have that. Like, fuck you guys. Put it like, this way, Minji. If, if I was going to marry you, herpes wouldn't matter. But, like, if we're just hanging out, just a casual thing, yes, herpes become a deal breaker. Like, uh, for, not that. Yeah, like, if, not if that that's that was a. a if that's a deal breaker for anyone, they can't hang out with like no. Like <laughs> I'm done. <laughs> like I'm I'm a like 30 year old lady looking for something serious. Like uh so if you're not gonna hang out with me, can't if you're not gonna hang out with me because I have herpes, fuck you, you're out of it. Well, here's the deal, Minji. I will say this as a dude, if I like was like in love with a woman and she mm. had herpes, then it's like, yeah, I love her and that could be like a long term partner then herpes like wouldn't be a deal breaker. But if it's just someone in passing, yeah, herpes is a deal breaker. Do you get what I'm saying? I mean, I get it. And then I... <laughs> like, 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 and then like that, I respect that. And then that's not going to, that, that's not going to get me. <laughs> it's not going to get you. Well, it's not going to get the other person. <laughs> that's, that's yeah, like, like, sorry, you got to go. Uh, apparently it is uh, going to get the other person. Hold on. But here's the deal. If you make out with someone that has herpes, can you get herpes? I mean, like, it's the, if you have herpes, like the mouth herpes, like the, there are like different types. What kind do you have? You're talking about like a cold sore? What is that? Cold sore? What is cold sore? Like a blister? Fever uh, blisters? Like, oh, uh, yeah, yeah. I don't have that. It's more like down there herpes, not like mouth herpes. Where you were really thinking about like, <laughs> you were you like actually thinking about like casually like hooking up with me, right? Why are you so disappointed? No, I'm, I'm, I'm just asking because I don't know the... I wasn't thinking of that. Trust me. I'm, I, I'm never thinking I'm getting laid ever. I, yeah, that's not... But um, so if you make out with someone that has herpes, can you get herpes that way? If you, if you're making out with someone who has mouth herpes, yes, you're you. Okay. It's likely that you would. But like when that person is like um taking some sort of medicine, um, I think that prevents them from spreading to someone else. Okay. But like, well, okay, let's say you're sixty nineing. Uh, can you transfer it that way? I don't think so. But like, would you make out? Would you not? You're only sixty nineing without making out with someone with mouth herpes. That's like dumb. Yeah, I mean, like, I can't kiss your mouth, but I'm gonna just go sixty nine on you. Now, do you let dudes know before you like hook up with them that like you do have herpes, or you just I do. like? I do. Oh, you do? Okay. No, I do. I'm like, by the way, I have herpes. <laughs> You know, when you like meet them for the first time, you should be like, hello, I'm Minji. I have herpes. That should be like your, you know, like your pronoun herpes. <laughs> Hi, I'm Minji. I'm herpes. I'm, I'm I have herpes. herpes. Minji. It, it's Korean for herpes. <laughs> my my middle Minji. name is herpes. Minji Herpes Co. Minji um, Herpes Co. <laughs> like, fuck you. It's not a big deal. Like, there's like a. I don't know. I think 30% of people in the world has herpes. <laughs> like for real. Like I'm, I'm thanks gonna, like, to you. <laughs> yes, I fuck all of them. <laughs> yes. But, I'm giving you shit. No, I Minji, I fucking yeah, yeah. I, I fucking no, I by the way, I never thought I was hooking up with you at all. I was just saying yeah, like, he, he, he didn't think he was gonna hook up with you he just thought he might yeah. help you do some paintings that's all yes i thought i was gonna give you a green card in the name of art 
we were gonna get married for a green card and do some art together. I was, was not gonna, I was not gonna casually hook up with you, but we're gonna get married and get you green cards. Yeah, yeah. I'm just, I'm just messing. With you. I'm just uh, and make baby <laughs> paintings. Chipping you, yeah, yeah. <laughs> But yes, um, all the shout out to all the herpes people. Shout to out to the thirty percent, the thirty percenters, thirty percent of the world, the thirty percenters. What's up? What's going yeah, on? Yeah, or you just don't know that they have herpes. You, maybe you want to get yourself checked. <laughs> they don't know. Yeah, sometimes you, like... you have herpes that you don't know. Oh, I, I just know that I have I had herpes for a while. How, how long did you have herpes and not know you had herpes? I think. Um, so I know, I think I know exactly where I had where I got herpes because I went to the, <laughs> the exact spot. It was exactly this, when. it was this so, bar stool. I knew they didn't clean it. They were supposed I, to wipe it down. I uh I went to a sex party once. Uh, and, uh, <laughs> it was a uh, uh, what? <laughs> oh, you guys all want to try it? Um, <laughs> not anymore you are the yeah, anti-sex no, party this is the anti-sex party talk right now <laughs> like i went to a sex party and i got her feet everyone should go everyone should try it become a 30 percenter become a 30 percenter and get some herpes yeah. why are you sitting on the couch suddenly you this should be the advertisement for netflix and chill like I went to a sex party and I got herpes. Don't go to like, sex party, yeah. just Netflix and chill because you're gonna get herpes. Actually, like for the fact, like I it absolutely enjoyed the sex party experience. Did so it stink? It, no, I, did I, it smell I don't think bad? Herpes, I don't think herpes stinks. Quad, let her tell her story. No, the think, room. When I don't, you I walked into the orgy, stinks. did it just like a big wasp of stink? stink? No, I've been That's to sex always, parties. Just not, hanging out. There's no problem with stink. hot sex. The thought of sex is great. It's the it, it's all it's like the uh, the 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 joke. Uh, Jim Jim uh, Jeffries he talks about that. Yeah, porn sounds great, but the problem with that is uh, you, you can't smell porn. Anyway, <laughs> I like you can't that. smell an orgy you, from like the, just thinking about it. The texture of is missing for all porn. Right, so go back to Minji's story. Uh, <laughs> Back to the so orgy. Tell me about this sex party and this uh, this orgy. Like, so I was, so I'm an artist. I also don't. You're an artist. You are an I'm, artist. I am an artist, and then I was get pay, I got paid to go to sex party because I was making art there. You got paid to get herpes. <laughs> like here's fifty. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, so, I'm sorry. Yeah, what's yeah. gonna happen to you after this? <laughs> and, uh, I apologize for the rest of your life, but. uh I, but she already has herpes and jizz. How much worse could it get? Now I get. Now I can go without worrying. Yeah, that's not what. Jizz. But um. Here's okay. fifty bucks, kid. Put it in your pocket. <laughs> hey, I got. I made more than fifty bucks. I made I'm like one hundred five. One two five for that gig. It was a sweet gig, and then I I was making you know like, I was painting the corner. Like painting people. the corner, that's what they call painting it. Painting the corner, painting the corner, painting the corner. Any happy endings? Watching people, watching the corner. Happy sex, and it who's was just next? Like, I'm painting the corner. Fuck <laughs> you! Why is that funny? I was just like, just I was painting the corner, in the corner, the corner, and then like just watching people having sex, and then like I'm a hot Asian lady painting in a corner, so people want to, you know. Give you herpes, of course. Yes, <laughs> like, you're like, you're like, I have a bunch of herpes to share. Yeah, hey, I, you want to be a 30 percenter? <laughs> you, what are you in? You into this? You want to be a 30 percenter? <laughs> she probably said, I don't know what herpes is, but I'm in. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. I'm into I mean, you don't know what the deal is until you get it, but, anyways, um. It was nice, and then like there was actually at that at that uh, sex party, there's a little corner, like, a, like another a little party. corner, a bunch of corners. Corner. There's a lot a of corners. Corner. Another corner. corner. <laughs> Turns out that's where all the people just sit and watch everyone else. Turns out corners coming for. Turns out these corners. the best thing about orgy is just watching. It's just like I'm like I don't want to. I know the worst thing about orgies herpes. Herpes are the worst thing about these orgies. Otherwise, they're cool. Otherwise, these, otherwise, these orgies are amazing. These herpes, though, 
outside of that everything's cool like if, you, if i was gonna like <laughs> never gonna say never going to sex party and never having herpes i would rather go to sex party and have herpes it was a yeah. great experience <laughs> we, we better to have herpes and lost than uh to never have had herpes at all honestly yes <laughs> Also, makes me. It makes me. I think after getting herpes, it makes me more like unattainable in a way. <laughs> like, yeah, you are unattainable. Yeah, you like, I'm sorry. Unattainable <laughs> or untouchable? Which one? <laughs> what are you, Al Capone over here with your herpes? <laughs> You're Al Capone like, with these herpes. Like You're the like a cast system. I was thinking of the cast system, the untouchable. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm like a goddess level who has herpes. So, like, if you want to get like get with me, just take some stupid risk just take some stupid I, risk i you thought it was if you want to get if you, you want to be, be my lover you got to get done with my friends not herpes it's like the as you said the cost system so non-herpes down here and the herpes up there do you want to be a 30 percent or not oh i you got my pyramid this? upside down that's what you're saying the top is the the herpes the top is the herpes that's the highest reachable point i got you <laughs> Noga under a black light raised chin would glow brighter than Midgey's paintings. No god. Noga's a good egg. I like Noga. Yeah, I recognize the um what's that profile? It's, uh, the the black quad. Who's more childhood? SJ or Ray and who's dumber? They Ray's were... dumber and more childish. You you're like as uh SJ's best friend right now. I don't get it. <laughs> Ray might start on his 15k salary without MLC now. Thank you, Johnny Payton. The two, oh, it's a picture of me. Ross's broken spirit, quad versus cabbie in the ring. Make it happen, Ray. Oh, yeah, because they're both in wheelchair. He's, yeah, yeah, he's he's messed up too. Oh, yeah, we, John you could just put here. like uh, you could put two stretchers next to each other and we could just like hit each other to see. see I knock will you out. send Stuttering John the link. He's here. I, I, Minji, I don't know if you know Stuttering. The Howard Stern show was a thing in the 90s. Yeah. He was on the tonight, he was the house announcer on the tonight show i like stuttering john and a better comedian than ray all right, all right. whatever go quads never seen me do comedy and stuttering john's never i've watched my i watched your dry bar no i've watched a bunch of it what are you talking right. about well stuttering john comes on then i'm kicking you and bringing stuttering john <laughs> just because we can't be in these uh you can't kick me off. I'm the ambassador of Rock Bottom Podcast. What are you talking uh, about? Amb <laughs> ambassador somewhere else. Uh, my <laughs> my ambassador's got herpes. If you don't have herpes, ambassador you can't Dave. play here. I'm hey, only down. All the thirty percent of the world is supporting you. I'm I'm only part of the thirty percent. I'm here to represent herpes. Yeah. Ambassador <laughs> somewhere else is the line of the day by far. Go ambassador <laughs> somewhere else. Minji. <laughs> How soon after meeting Ray did you realize he was adult? Bear in mind, he's been saying you guys first met last summer at a Halloween show. I don't know what. We met at a Halloween show. Yeah. The I said last guy. summer. Yeah. What is adult? Ad adult means, I, I guess, an idiot is what he's trying to call me. He's from Europe. He's got this weird ease. Euro. Euro he's style. a good man, though. I like Mr. Ray. Be Mr. Ray. He's a good guy. I, I think the um, I, I recognize the id rapey ray it's very funny yeah stuttering john minji hit me up when uh you're in la uh misery loves on show us on a map where people stop being asian i <laughs> i don't know i don't know uh what do you mean? no that i always get confused by that too because they have india and bangladesh yeah. and all that stuff in uh asia i don't get it <laughs> Jackson Clemens, you have what now? <laughs> Damn, this is a hard way to find out watching Rock Bottom Podcast. That's a hard way to find out. Lesson learned, Drexton. 30 percenter. You're a 30 percenter, Drexton. <laughs> Break him the news. I Come am, on, Midgey. He's I a 30 percenter. Drex, <laughs> Drexton, you should have worn a condom, buddy. Should have worn a condom. Oh, oh. 
Last summer, I gave you my heart. The very I gave next you her piece. <laughs> Last <laughs> summer, I gave you. You're her a thirty piece. percenter, dude. Welcome to the thirty percent club. <laughs> 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 Can you move on? Yeah. <laughs> Rayman, you can count cards. Sure, I can. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, Ray, yeah, you're going, going to, to Vegas, bud. After Let's see this. Yeah. You're going to well, Vegas. Great show with John skills. and Vincent Lawyer. Bravo. Edgar's a fan of yours. He likes you. Hell yeah, man. Appreciate Ray, it. tell us more about how you went to sex parties just to hang out. No sex... <laughs> Infants, yes, yes. Uh, no copper tongue babies there. No, it's more uh, yeah, like have my you ever... friends. It was like a sex party, and it's like I was just there with my friends, and it's like, all right, I'm just. That's New York City, though. You just like, you be hanging with other comics, like, hey, we're going over here. All right, what's going on? You're like, hey, hey. I wanted to be a thirty percent. Yeah, dude. Like, <laughs> that is. Minji, what's your body count that you gave herpes to? You don't have to answer that. Uh, yeah, yeah, it's mandatory. You have to answer that. You don't have to answer that. Uh, <laughs> I mean, no, over no. fifty or less than fifty. How many people do you have sex with like after 50? you've had? After you need more than fifty. After, after herpes, uh, post herpes body count, I think two. Two. Yeah. So two got in the. <laughs> Only two have gotten herpes. Stop showing me that That bastard. Did you have it before or after him? It was after. It was after? Okay, okay. So I, I he's am, in the clear. I, he's a hoe, too. Like, he should have. Like, just go. He should his, have it. He should have I'm it. Sure you're, I'm sure you're 30% drugs. <laughs> He should have it. <laughs> He's a hole. You're a hole. <laughs> You're a hole. You have herpes. That's the rule. <laughs> What's hole, worse, yeah. Asian herpes or black guy herpes? Yeah, are the herpes Asian different shit. in Asia? No, it's herpes. Same shit. Yeah. It's the same right? shit. You said it like you, you say that like you've seen a lot of herpes. You say like you've seen Asian herpes. You've seen white herpes. You've seen black herpes. You say it like you see. You sound like you've seen a lot of herpes, Minji. <laughs> I, I, just to be clear, I I do talk to people about this, and then like only you two, only two post post herpes body count. Only two. <laughs> And you gave him the heads up before that. Surprisingly, the person who, one of the post herpes body count person, told me that he doesn't have herpes. herpes so, there's hope. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's like it's like he's one of like, he's one of the seventy percenters. <laughs> still, <laughs> still, poor guy. He tried, but still he's not in the thirty percent. <laughs> okay, so. <laughs> and I, you know, I think it's a lot like Russian roulette. Like, you can pull the trigger a lot, but eventually, no, it's Korean it's roulette. Gonna go off. It's Korean roulette. It's Korean roulette. Korean. When it comes to Minji, it's, it's Korean, Korean roulette. roulette. You know how like ladies like always have to like risk getting pregnant when they have like sex. Yeah, we have to risk getting always. herpes. That's yeah. the Russian so, like, roulette you have we play. To, like, one layer of risk into you know accessing me. I I actually. I fucking enjoy this. Like, I'm like, again, I enjoy this. Untouchable. Like, it's like enjoying like, like, like shooting infants. You know I, I enjoy this. Like, this is, actually, this is what I'm into. I'm sorry. Happy. Like, no. <laughs> I'm getting flashbacks of uh, Deer Hunter with Robert De Niro. Mao! Yeah, it's Mao. like playing right like Mao. Mao. That movie? I don't know that movie, but like, sounds about, sounds about it, right? It's, it's before I was born, too. It's from like the early 70s. But it's a, it's a great movie. It um, Robert De Niro, uh, Christopher Walken, but they were, they were in Vietnam and they did Russian. Uh, they did roulette. This, there was no Russian, so it's Vietnam soldiers. That had it's... Them. <laughs> so the, All right, here we go like again. So many guns in their thing, and they're like, ah, and like if there there's some missing in the chamber, so you just got to be like, see if you got the bullet or if you or if it was an empty chamber. That's all. Uh, that, that's all I mean. But, dude, I didn't know that. Vibe. Minji, I'm glad you're being honest, though. I mean, that's fucking cool, you being honest. And I will say this. 
if there was a random hookup, um, yeah, uh, I, I don't want to get herpes, but yeah. <laughs> Sounds Minji, like a great name Min of a new special, though. Herpes. Just to call Min your Minji special herpes, like, Minji. <laughs> Minji's like, you think we get to fuck some chick this hot if you didn't get herpes? Stop it. Just <laughs> quit being ridiculous. You get to fuck. There's a trade off chick. here. There's a trade off. You get exactly. to tell everyone how you fucked the hottest chick you ever fucked. I, <laughs> that's what you got to tell people, Minji. Like, I think that should be my comedy bit. You're right. You're yeah, so yeah, yeah, like, you get to <laughs> use it as a joke. Like, you get to, like, yeah. Own, like, Joe Liss has herpes. He talks about it. Like, you could tell. Ellie Wong, too. Ellie Wong did, like, a really beautiful herpes bit. Like, I. I oh, so her. that's what you. I knew Allie back in the day, like in New York. She, we used to do the same shows together. Allie was always cool. I mean, she's now famous. She I love through. Allie Wong. Yeah, I know you do. I saw your <laughs> set. I saw your set. Yeah, uh, uh, Godfather, for the um, context, I um, I did, we met at a roast battle, Halloween edition, and then I was dressing up as Allie Wong doing like an opening bit. and I. So you didn't you know, wear a costume at all then? No, she yeah, was I was like she was pregnant. pregnant. Wearing yeah. a tiny dress. I will say this about Minji. She's got very nice legs, and I saw her legs in the, like, yeah, her legs are. You wouldn't know she had herpes by looking. <laughs> she had very sexy legs. <laughs> you would not think that herpes would be like, ah! Fuck Did you, you do comedy uh, you. when you guys met? Stop Asian hate. Stop, stop herpes hate. Stop Asian hate. I love it. Like, that's what, so, like, if you say anything negative about a Jewish person, it's like, oh, you obviously hate Jews. It's like, no. It's, stop, it's, stop her piece hate. Stop her piece hate. Her piece very stop bad representative. Wow. Um, Father, what were you saying? Uh, <laughs> when's the last time you did comedy? Did you do comedy when you met him on the Halloween thing? Uh, yeah, yeah, I was doing, I was doing stand up. Um, and then I talked about, like, hooking up with a Scorpio dude. And then he's like, I'm a Scorpio. I'm a Scorpio, yeah. Yeah. What's your sign? Yeah. Father. Herpes. Herpes. <laughs> I'm gonorrhea over here. I'm gonorrhea. <laughs> <laughs> I'm AIDS. I'm full blown AIDS over here. I'm, uh, <laughs> I'm all about AIDS. Here's your <laughs> <laughs> I got so many AIDS. It's all I got is AIDS. Just a bunch of AIDS. Uh, uh, <laughs> I mean, nobody wants to get herpes, but hey, if you get it from Minji, that's not bad. <laughs> like, it's one of those things where, like, I got herpes from this chick. And you show the picture, like, worth it. it. I'm like, worth it. Yeah, you're worth <laughs> it. You're worth it. Um, <laughs> you're worth getting herpes for. Um, <laughs> How romantic is this? Sadly, I don't want to get herpes. <laughs> if I wasn't, if I was down for getting herpes, I'd be like, I want him from Minji. Minji <laughs> is who I want herpes from. Who, who do you want to make you a thirty percenter? I'd be like Minji. If you, get, if you were to get herpes from anyone, that should be me. Yes. 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 If I had to get herpes from anyone, I would want herpes from Minji. I want herpes from Minji. <laughs> like, uh, it's like I feel like I, I, you know what, Minji? I would show it off. Like, dude, these are herpes from Minji. Look, look at these herpes. Look at these herpes, dude. I, got I thought Minji, they looked dude. familiar. Look at these. It's like, dude, it's like getting a new tattoo. Like, look at these herpes, dude. I got it from Minji. I got herpes all over the place, dude. I got so many herpes. They're all from Minji. It's like a war, war wound, war wound. Like, it's like I cried. You know. I got so many herpes, dude. <laughs> I say, like, dude, I fucked her so good. Look at all the herpes I got. Look at all Shut the up. I fucked her so Shut good. The fuck up. I got all her herpes, dude. Is that how it works, herpes. Ray? The better sex you have, the more you get. The like, more herpes the more you herpes, get, like, dude. The I got more all her herpes, dude. Is. Yeah, I got herpes all over the place. I got herpes on my shoulder. I didn't even know you can get them on your shoulder. <laughs> that is how good. That's how good we had sex, dude. I got herpes on my shoulders. I, I got a herpes on my eyelid, dude. That's what we did. You don't even know. You don't even she know, was dude. Sitting on me. Yeah, I made her squirt so bad, dude. Dude, I fucked her so hard. My roommate got herpes. That is <laughs> killing my roommate. It's like it got it. It got on the carpet and he stepped on it. Now he's got herpes. He's a thirty percenter, dude. I fucking did it. I fucking did it. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, fucking Minji, you're the best, man. Everybody fucking loves you, dude. 
<laughs> Thank you. I mean, also, I think I should. I have comedy show later today, so I think I'm gonna use that um, bit. That's, oh, you want to jump up? All right, Mindy, what's your body count too? We got that. Are right, you? You can. Oh, one more from Dexter. I don't think that's what she was saying, Ray. Oh, 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 what is, oh! Why are people message me saying that I got devetoed? Uh, what does no. that even mean by devetoed again? No, that's that's Kevin being mad at me when something goes wrong. He says devetoed. Like that's not like. Yeah, Kevin's mad at me because like. I think uh, I. We gotta we gotta jump on a call, Drax. Like we'll we'll do that. It's I would just explain. <laughs> I'll I'll do I'll tell you what, I'll do MLC with you sometime and it'll be fun. Like Kevin does love me and I love Kevin. So we'll get through this this fucking hate that uh whatever the fuck is going on. So what are you saying? You got a comedy show later tonight? I do have a comedy show later tonight. It's it's like twelve right now, but um <clears throat> twelve in the like noon. But I think I should use that herpes beat. Bit. I, I like that. I like that a lot. You should do that. Yeah, yeah. I'm I pretty should, good. I I'm gonna, thank you guys. jokes. That. That's a great copy. Yes. <laughs> 30%. I mean, it'd kind of be redundant if you called it Asian herpes over there, though, right? Like, it, that wouldn't even matter. Or are you I, going to an English club? Or are you, do you speak oh, uh, yeah, Korean yeah. at the club? So there are both Korean and English scene. In, Korean and English comedy scenes like two exist in this country and then i'm doing english bit today by the way you speak english amazingly thank you yeah i mean you you do it like i know i would never even think like you have another language like how well you speak english but i'm a dumb american where we know one dumb language it's i think That's like i idea. like I, I was I used to enjoy learning different languages like uh, I tried Chinese, <clears throat> Norwegian, a bunch of different yeah. languages. But like yeah, once dude, I, I started, heard, hmm? I heard your Norway story, dude. Yeah, how I, great I, I are, like, like, dude, I just assume everyone in Norway is fucking a sex god or goddess. Like they're just like apparently yeah, they yeah. keep the best looking people on the planet all in norway that's all i want on norway is everyone there's like a fucking god or goddess and it's like i don't know what the this fucking little fucking shit up in the fucking snow mountains that's going on there they, they are like so tall like uh blue eyes yeah like that was like pre-herpes season so that doesn't really count oh that was pre herpes do you remember when you got herpes I told you that specific night at that stupid sex party. That oh, was sex like, party. That was, that's like I, I don't want to know who the guy is, but was he a comic? I don't. Know I have was, no idea who that person. No was. idea. The guy just. <laughs> like, I, I'm like this is the day. I'm like person I, or persons. I, did you did you have sex with a bunch of people at the orgy? I was a little girl painting at a corner. People want to fuck me. I'm like. You're like okay, wow. I'm You're scared. like I didn't know I had it. Yeah, yeah. But I by, by the way, like not that I'm. I mean, I think you're fucking sexy as shit, and you're fucking adorable. And uh, that, but you're yes, not trying I to would, paint her into a corner. Yeah, but go ahead. I, 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 yeah, I would not assume that if we hung out, like that could like I would not assume that. Like I'm that I have herpes. No, that uh, that what? I could have sex with you or whatever so that that hurt me that you said like i wouldn't put you in that position to be like then i found out you had herpes so i don't want to be in that position <laughs> don't want yes. but if there was a woman i was gonna marry i wouldn't uh, i wouldn't mind getting herpes that, but, that's what yeah. basically that's what ellie said ellie Wong said like in the like special he's like she's like he gave me the ring i gave him herpes like you oh how romantic like, yeah yeah you know equal transaction yeah it has nothing to do with anyone but like, well, yeah, i don't know about gonna... equal but it was a transaction but it if was, i was in a serious yeah. relationship where i was gonna marry a woman i wouldn't i wouldn't mind having herpes so i could have sex with my wife but like if it's just a random thing like eh, i'm like eh, i'm not yeah like just yeah. like a random dude just like, luckily for like, minji talk to me i have herpes <laughs> you do wear a sign that just says herpes. <laughs> herpes. Like you should have a sign that says I. 
Mm. Get herpes from a hot chick. Get herpes from hot chick. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Get herpes from hot chick. You Just know, herpes weird. question mark. That's all the shirt has. Just herpes and a question mark. If people come up to you and like, so where's this hot chick I get herpes from? <laughs> <laughs> or wear a shirt that says, ask me about my herpes. Yeah. Oh, I like that. That's yeah. a merch. That's yeah. a merch. No, I just think it's funny if you like get hoppy herpes from a hot chick and someone's like, so anyways, where's this hot chick I get herpes from? And you're just sitting there like, all right. They're I, around. I think I'm you can find one. I'm writing it right now. Uh, quad great show with John and Vince, a lawyer. Um, Ray, tell us more about you went to sex party, just hang out. Um, no, I was at a sex party. I, it was more like comics were going like, all right. And I went and hung out. Mindy, what's your body count too? We went through that. Why are people messaging me saying I got DeVito? That's from Drex and Chris. Why are you watching this, Drex? He, that's not him. You know that's not him. That's just people messing with you. That's not him. You think so? Yeah, that's not him. Trust me, that's not him. No, I think that's uh, Drex. Yeah, I just checked that it's him. It's the real one. How did you check? Uh, magically the on the internet. Oh, it went to his YouTube page? Yep. Dude, he's one of my podcasts whenever. Um, but yeah, you were, you didn't have it at the time you guys were doing your thing. Decline to answer. Okay. All right. I, I will leave. All right. Our Russians <laughs> in San. All right. We're not, that's very nice. You miss really loves onions for sending that super chat, but we can quad show Minji your mini quad. These. <laughs> He wants, uh, that's him saying he wants Jimmy him Fallon. To show you. That yeah, always his yeah. me. It's funny. Jimmy Fallon. Shrex got unminchied. Unminchied. Uh, oh, same. Hoagie Boy Ray, how long you've been in Nambla? That's, uh, do you know about Nambla? I didn't know about it. I didn't know. You just it learned about Nambla on MLC. We all know about Nambla because we watch MLC <laughs> and Ray. That's hilarious. I mean, I know about it now. But like, how do they have a website? Let's say that's a real thing. <laughs> how do they have a website? How do they like form and like, we got to get signatures. We got to petition and make this a thing that happens. I don't know, but I can guarantee I won't go look into it after the show. I don't think I want to Google anything near that. Oh, because it's just like fucks up with your... um, I don't want to be on Homeland Security's like watch list or some shit. You don't want to be a 30 percenter? (laughs) I don't know if you get... Is that part of NAMBLA? You have to get herpes for your induction or something? No, I, have, I still have no idea what it is. People like just told me about it after the fact. I'm not. But you're in. Um, that someone asked. Uh, yeah, Kevin said, "What's an Amala?" And uh, Ray said, "I don't know what it is, but I'm in." So that's, yeah, that's a sound funny. drop on MLC now. It's that's back good. when we were best friends, when we were besties, and then Aww. I was like, "Hey." Someone offered me to go to Vegas and pay me money and fly me out there and give me a hotel room. And Kevin signed off on it. And then he's like, wait a minute, why are you going? It's like, I, I'm not canceling. So now he I hates mean, me and Pat Dixon just because of that. I mean, uh, you... but good for you, Minji. You get to be on there all the time now. And he's <laughs> going to pay you. He's going to pay you to be on it just to spite me. Be like, hey. But like, uh, you know, like you, if you are going to lose, you, you are bound to lose that person, I think, at some point. I believe in that, you know. Like, yeah, it's it's fine. I'm I'm fine. I still love Kevin, and I'll, I'll go back on the podcast and have fun, fun sometime if he ever wants me back. But yeah, wait, we've so always been cool. How how long? So when are you gonna do? How long are you gonna do this podcast? Because I need to go take a shower. Oh, oh, you you can you can roll whenever. Yeah, you can roll. I'm the uh, Noga says you can lose your virginity and get herpes at the same time. <laughs> if it's Minji, I'm in. We'll do that. <laughs> Herbie's from Minji, a thirty percenter. All right, you you can you can jump off. Okay, Minji. Uh, I'll um, I'll try to check in after 
put after shower and no, no worries. And by the way, like, uh, so I'm in New York City next week, but I'm getting there Monday. I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go to the stand Monday, uh, hang out for Skanks, maybe do Frantic if they got a spot for me. And then I got. Uh, I'm on the show Tuesday. At like the not the coming Monday, but like the week after. That's like no, no. I'm there in- this coming. I'm in Detroit oh, okay. this weekend. So I might miss you because the next weekend I'm at the Church of Satire in um, in Hanover, uh, Pennsylvania. But I'll be back in May. So I'll, I'll, I'll see you. Minji, yeah. you're, you're, you're my buddy. You're, you're my buddy. I'm not. Uh, first of all, I always thought you were sexy. But then I heard not that I was going to not that I thought that was an option. But then hearing the whole herpes story is like, hey, you should just say that guys you don't want to fuck. But I have herpes. Fuck I have herpes. herpes. Like, I got herpes. <laughs> Ray, what's your thoughts about it? Yeah, I, I'll, I'll talk about that. I'll let Minji go. Minji, I love you, my dear. And uh, you, yeah, we'll, we'll hang out. Regardless. You're the best. Okay, good to meet you. Have a good one. Good to meet you, Kai. Yeah. Okay. Minji's the best. Everyone loves Minji. Ray, what's your thoughts about Diddy? Yeah, so that's fucked up. So P. Diddy had a guy. As, uh, I, his name's sir. Diddy. Come on, think about it. Diddler, Diddy. Come it makes no, sense right, now. Stop. You're not even like getting the story. But like, so he had a drug runner. He had a guy who was a basketball player at Syracuse that um, was like, he, he got arrested at an airport um, for like trafficking drugs. Oh, I thought it was sex trafficking. I thought no, that's what no, the no, charges no, no. were. Um, no, it has nothing to do with um, uh, Syracuse basketball player. So, th- yeah, so this dude got arrested for apparently, like, um, running drugs. By-, by the way, how great is Minji, though? Like, isn't she fucking awesome? Yeah, Minji. everything but one thing is really yeah, awesome yeah, yeah, about yeah. Minji. By the way, I never thought like I was ever, uh, but like, yeah, yeah, like it's. Boy, oh boy, yeah, are they going to have conversations that... about Minji in New York now when she gets back, right? Uh, hey, if I had to get herpes from someone, why not Minji? You can get herpes from a lot worse. Get herpes from a hot chick. That's what I say. She's fucking gorgeous. Are you kidding me? She's fucking gorgeous. She's. And she's a cool chick on top of it. Not only is she gorgeous, she's a fucking hot chick on top of it. Or or a cool chick. So, yeah, this dude. So this fucking basketball player, Brendan Paul, uh, got arrested at an airport. He's like, um, would bring drugs into the country for for P. Diddy. And I, I don't know the extent of it, what the fuck happened. Um, oh, he's from Ohio, so hell yeah. Yeah, see, Sean Diddy Combs, Holmes raided amid sex trafficking allegations. That's exactly what it says right there. The, up, go up a little, right there, stop. Wait, 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 wait. Go back down. Well, you just oh, flew right past Oh, sex trafficking? In the, oh, I know nothing about that. Yeah, it's supposed yeah, that, to be like... Yeah, that, that's what started this whole thing. The P. Diddy oh, really? stuff is all about him being a sex trafficker. His uh, his house in Florida and and in uh, California were raided at the same time. They went through all of his stuff. It's like the Department of Homeland Security came Damn. to his house. Damn. So that yeah, like, like started this whole shit. Yeah, I mean, and I wasn't joking about being a diddler. That's like the allegation is that he touched like Usher and Justin Bieber and like all these people. Why would he touch them? I'm not making this shit up. Yeah, This is not a joke. Did Justin Bieber and them come out and say that? Like, that'd be weird. Like, they would, I think they would automatically call him out on that. Like those well, I mean, so if there's going to be civil cases or criminal charges, like uh, you don't always just come out in the public and say what happened to you. It might it might take a minute to get the story out, but we'll figure it out. It just happened the other day, so it's a brand new story. You you know the story that I think it's insane is that Otani thing, the gambling thing. Like there's that Toronto Raptors player who's like a bench player, and I guess a bunch of people started like nobody ever bets on this guy and. 
then one day out of nowhere, like on DraftKings or something, there was like fucking like $50 million worth of bets of people betting how many shots he takes. Uh, and they all took the under and like he like left the game after one minute. And it's like, oh, and like now that guy's suspended. This guy from Toronto. Did you see this story? Or you have no idea what the fuck I'm talking about. No, I hadn't heard the story, but I always assumed the NFL and the NBA are uh, entertainment, you know, businesses. They're now, not the listed as sports. This is so I think it's all insane. fixed. I think all that stuff's fixed. That's my point. No, th- this one's insane. I mean, I think this dude's like. Uh... Well, we've seen refs get busted. We've seen players get busted before, mostly NCAA, but. Um, I think there's been a couple of players in the NBA that have said that they did stuff like that. Point shaving. No, th- this guy like got uh, tanked. Yeah. John T. Uh, Porter. So this dude. Prop bet irregularities. So yeah, he just, he probably has an average amount of points he scores per game and whatever. He, he, he averages four points a game. But yeah, like, so he, everyone bet the under on it, right? And then he left the game. Pretty simple. He, yeah, he left the game after like, but it was like weird as shit because like, I 4. think what 4. like, uh, well, the thing that like met, made it like weird is he's a nobody, so no one ever bets on him, and then all of a sudden, like, uh, Forty million dollars worth of bets about how many shots he takes come in, and they're all like the under. So like they're like, oh wait, this is abnormal. No one ever gave a fuck about John Tay Porter before, and suddenly everybody in the world's betting on this, and they're betting like large amounts of money, and so he's suspended indefinitely. Like so, he's pretty much done. He's probably going to be done. And then again, it's not a big deal in the realm of the NBA because he's not a big, because he's not a big deal. But at the same time, Otani, who's like the star of Major League Baseball, um, paid $5 million worth of gambling debts for his interpreter. And from his bank account, and somehow nobody, like somehow he still gets to play. And it's only because he's a superstar. I think Otani's going to probably be like d- done for. Um, and you know what? Major League Baseball doesn't want it because he's like a superstar power hitter and he's a superstar pitcher. And he just signed a giant contract with LA. So, like, they don't want this. Major League Baseball does not want Otani out of anyone in Major League Baseball. It's more like you could take Mike Trout, you could take whoever, don't take Otani. He's the face of the Major League Baseball. So, and they won't Face of the Asians, him. too, and that's a big market also. So, they definitely don't want to lose, like, a tie to the Asians. Yeah, like... You if, know, they love that. Having uh, Where is he from? Is he a Korean? Is that correct? I don't think Japan. he's Japanese. Think is he yeah, Japanese? I think, yeah, I think he's from... Oh, Tani. Yeah, I guess that would be. I mean, I don't know. I don't know, but I, I think... He's is he the guy that pitches left-handed and right-handed? He, like... Or he can switch hit or something like that. No, he he pitches and then he hits. He's like a major power hitter. And then when he's not, he pitches once every five days. He's like a great pitcher. But then also when he's not pitching, he's like the designated hitter and hits a bunch of home runs. So he's like a a giant star in Major League Baseball. So this is a, a big deal. I don't think they're, you know what's sad? he's like such a marketing person like if pete rose would like they got pete rose at the end of his line um but if like all the major league baseball depended on pete rose they probably would not have suspended pete rose ray they don't treat you your kind nice in prison talking about me all right fine i'm trying to get her if i was going to get herpes i would get it from minji who wouldn't I, I think she's fucking awesome. But uh, so that's what I think. I think that's, um, what do you call it? So if, yeah, if um, Otani was not the biggest player in baseball, he'd be out right now. He would not be playing. 
like that guy from Toronto who's a nobody, he's probably never going to play in the NBA again. He's like done. Yeah, for sure. But if Ohtani, uh, Shoei Otani gets in trouble, he'll probably what miss a season. I don't think they're even going to suspend him. I think they're really going to try to play it. Uh, this is how I believe. Um, I, I think they're going to try to play it off on his interpreter. Like, and it's only getting weirder and weirder because more stories are coming out that like he knew about it the whole time. So yeah, it, it's going to be curious to see what happens, but I'm curious to see what major league baseball does because like, He's obviously guilty of some shit. Some shit's there. You know what I mean? And he's their biggest star. He's the biggest star in baseball. So, yeah, it, it, it's weird. It's, it's going to be weird. And they want an international guy that ties everything together. So, it's going to be weird to see what happens. But he's playing tonight. He's on the active Mike roster. Trout's not the biggest name in baseball still? No, it's Otani, Otani, uh, by a wide mile. So, all right, I'm going to jump off. I'm going to get ready. I want to thank everyone. You're going to leave me here by myself? No, no, no. I think we're. You're going to jump off your own podcast like Kevin? Yeah, yeah. We're 30 percenters. What happened on. uh, No, no, we're 60 percenters, Ray. She was a 30 percenter. We're 60 percenters. Hey, if everyone that has herpes is as hot as Minchie. I want to be a 30 percenter. There's a reason 30 percent of people have herpes. Because they're all hot. Only hot they're out there herpes. doing stuff. That should be our T-shirt. Only hot people have herpes. Only hot people have herpes. Like, you got to be active to get herpes. You got to be in it to win it, right? <laughs> Is that how they say? Um, but, yeah, so tell me what uh, happened on Stuttering John today. Because, like, uh, I don't know if he sent me the link today. I think he sent it to me yesterday. But I wasn't around today. I think he sent it to me today, but I have no idea. What I miss? Uh, I don't know. Me, whatever. Me, Vincent, stuttering. John hung out for a couple hours. Had some laughs. It was. Um. Nothing. Nothing too major. Obviously. Um, he showed, he showed some dude walking across his front lawn that I'm sure Vince sent to his house. That was funny. I don't know. There wasn't much, there wasn't many major topics today. It's all good. That's right. The talking baseball, the down to end the time, the talking baseball, uh, Willie, Mickey and the Duke. That's uh, who, who sang that song? Do you remember that song? Like, I just remember that, like, being around when I was a little kid. The talking baseball. Da -da, and Mickey Mantle, the talking baseball. Da -da. It's Willie, Mickey, and the Duke. That's all I, I cared about when I was a kid was playing baseball and collecting baseball cards. That's for sure, man. You were a big uh, baseball Mickey player or you just saw basketball? I probably collect more uh, talking baseball. No, played. Passman. Played. Oh, when I was like a real little kid, probably yeah. baseball. But um, yeah, when I got like middle school, like I was basketball. I was just all basketball. Yeah, ba ba basketball is like uh, it's definitely my sport. It's a sport I was definitely the best at. And yeah, I, I could still fuck around and do some shit in basketball. Like, yeah. And I'm a allegedly, shit too. yeah, yeah, not anymore. I'm a fucking old man. Like my knees don't work. I'll, I'll play with like those dudes from Gas Digital, and um, which I'm I've seen them play. Them I'm play. not impressed. Yeah, Big yeah, J I'm moves like a brick, and and uh, I mean, Louis Jigo, he's fucking, he's athletic, no, Lewis, but he Lewis, has Lewis, no Lewis, game, dude. He doesn't play. No he game. doesn't play. Um, it's more. The he's producers. athletic though. The um, the staff that works at the stand plays with us and they're like Brandon and them and they're they're good athletes. Dave Smith is good, right? Uh yeah, Dave Smith's good. He doesn't play, but Dave Temple plays, he's good. Um uh, yeah. Um also uh who else plays? Dylan Dylan Nedry. Now he's calling himself uh Dylan James. He's he's uh, he's good. He's a young kid that's uh he's a good basketball player. But yeah, I, I could play for an old man. 
I can still, uh, I, I just can't jump. I can't jump with confidence. I got to check my legs. I'm sorry to bring that up to you as I, I said. But I'm not even going to say, like, um, that's my favorite old-time uh, baseball song, talking baseball, uh, allegedly, but also really. I'm going to say my favorite old-timey baseball song would be that uh, John Fogarty song. Put me in, coach. I'm ready to play. Today, look at me. I can be center field. You know that song? Of course, man. Yeah. Put me in, coach. I'm ready to play today. Yeah, I'd probably agree look with that. Look at me. I can be center field. Uh, yeah. Round yeah, round when I was a kid growing up, I always thought I always thought Credence was like Southern. I always figured they were from the South or something. No, because uh, they would say that. When I got, they're from like California or something. Yeah, they're he's literally from like San Jose area. Born on the bayou. No, you're not, dude. Born no, on the bayou. You were born by the you're bay. Not, you're, yeah, 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 you're not by born the bay. Bayou. Born on the bayou. You had more of a reason to sing uh, "Sitting on the Dock of the Bay" than Otis Redding did. But then also on that same note. Um, Tupac was always talking about his West Coast. Like, dude, you grew up in Baltimore. You cannot be any more East Coast than Baltimore. I don't know if you know how the map of the United States works, but Baltimore is on the East Coast. You're from the East Coast, dude. You know, just embrace. You're from the fucking East Coast. Who gives a shit? You're not from West Side. That's how bad Baltimore uh, public schools are. Tupac grew up there and thought he was from California. <laughs> that is how bad their fucking schools are. All right. I love yeah. everybody. Alleged but also really. Thanks for hanging. Minji was great. Quad was great. And uh, oh, shit. We got another super chat coming in. Quad was talking trash about you on SJ. Nambla excited. Were yeah. you really talking shit about me, man? Is that yeah, what I like, said? Yeah, what you got a problem with that? I don't give. I, I don't give a fuck. But what, what did you I, I say said, about me? Uh, I said you're funnier than Ray Stuttering John. That's what I said. I said you're a better comedian, Stuttering John. Don't you forget it. You teach that Ray a lesson. If you ever get a chance to roast battle him, you better fucking. Uh, you better show him up for me, Stuttering John. I know you can do it. Go watch some Stuttering I, John clips, and then go watch uh, my shit. If we're just talking stand-up comedy jokes, but yes, I'm sure. Wow, you really ball washing them? That now I feel like Brennan. Ball, like really oh, ball son of a bitch! We're gonna end it on this sour of a note. You're coming after me. I I'm don't. a ball washer now because I hung out with Stuttering John today. I don't care if you hang out with. Stuttering and I may John. Have, or may have complimented him. I don't know. But you never seen him do stand-up. There's no way. No, I've never seen him yeah, do stand-up. You never seen me do. Stand-up. I so just assume like... he's better than Dodge. No, Come on, Ray. Come on. I don't care. I, I was like, I c- come on, man. West Side. <laughs> I was like, West Side till I die. Pop, pop. Thug, love, thug, love. Pop, pop. Thug, love, thug, love. Pop, pop. They had uh, that West Side connection there for a minute, right? Yeah. I guess that was after Tupac, though, right? Early 2000s, maybe. Late. Uh, no, that was still late 90s. Fuck yeah, it was. But, uh, now, dude, this was fun. Minji was great. You're fucking great. Make white in a Burger King bathroom. That's uh, that's digital underground. underground. And you know what? That's what's weird, allegedly, but also really. But like, uh, Tupac started out in um, shot a backup G. dancer. Nah, it's not even he's a backup dancer, but uh, he was with Digital Underground. Like uh, Shock G from Digital Underground did his beats. Like, I get around, around it, round, round it, round, around we go. And then, like, so he was, like, more like just pop, like, with Digital Underground. I love Digital Underground. And they were just, like, silly as shit and everything. Like, Digital Underground's fucking amazing. Uh, do what you like. I, I, that's the first song I remember of theirs. Then they did the song from also uh, on the Adams Family. Um, um, the uh, the beat Hammer from the song. A- the beat from the song he's talking about, though, that I like the beat in that. Same old song. It's the same old, same old song. Just the same old song, you know. Uh, no, Diddle Underground was great, but um, yeah, two like, uh, but this came from Just Make One and Burger King Bathroom was from um, 
Di uh, Digital Underground, Shock G, his song like the Humpty Hump. I once got busy in the a Humpty Dance. Bathroom. Yeah, the Humpty Dance. Humpty Dance your is your chance to do the Hump. I once got busy in a Burger King bathroom. Yeah. Look at me. You were up. talking about that movie again, though, with Demi Moore, Dan Aykroyd, and all that. Chevy Chase. Yeah. That's what you're going to reference. Yeah. I once got busy in a Burger King bathroom. Yeah. I, I'm the one that's just I, grab them in the biscuits. Uh, that movie comes hilarious. up all the time, and I can never remember the name of it for some reason. What? It's a great movie, too. Oh, the one with John Candy, all that. What is it? Uncle Buck. I'm looking fast. Uh, nothing but trouble, 1991. There you go. Yeah, they uh, the judge lets them go because they're cool. They're not bankers or lawyers or uh, uh, politicians. They're stealing money and taxes from super chats. <laughs> ah, you son of a bitch! All right, get him. He's in a wheelchair. All right, Stuttering John's funnier than you. He's a better comedian. Yeah, I'm, I'm sure. I'm sure. I'm the worst. I don't like me either. Um, no, God, Ray. You ever see the Teletubbies? <laughs> Sexy, right? Jesus Christ! Come on, man. No, bro. come on, man. I don't want herpes, but if I got to get herpes from someone, it's Minji. Who would not want herpes? Oh, I thought you were going to say Teletubbies. Get herpes from Teletubbies. No, Minji's where you go. Hot chicks got herpes. I want to be a 30 percenter. Uh, does, she, does she have herpes paintings? I don't I don't know. I don't know if uh, it's like, dude, look how hot this chick was. Look at all these herpes she gave me, dude. She was all over me. Look at these herpes. No, she's fucking awesome. She's fucking She's great. She's an asset to the podcast community. We all love her. You can still go her. with her. You just got to wear condoms. That's it. Two of them or three of them. Whatever. Something like that. A few. How many do we have to wear? Uh... <laughs> well, I know that was the best, dude. <laughs> that was fucking hilarious. Whoever you are, you fucking are hilarious. Yeah. I like how she thought that was actually him. Like he's not know, randomly listening. We let her think so for I, I said it was him. Yeah, it's it's all good. All right, man. Yeah, Thanks good. for hanging, buddy. You're a good man. Hell yeah. You're handsome. We'll do this again soon. Always appreciate you hanging with me, buddy. Yeah, I got a ladies' night tomorrow night. So come check out uh BYB guys. Uh we got Keanu, uh, KB, Little Emmy, uh, Stormy, Sheila Aliens. We got a whole uh, a ladies' say, night. I would like stopping by for a little bit. I bet you yeah. would, and you won't no, be getting no, the link tomorrow. No, no, I don't want to. You say Keanu, I'm like, um. no, it's 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 a ladies' night. It's uh, their night. They get a party on Friday night. It's, but I like uh, everyone else them, you said. Everyone else I liked. But yeah, I'm like, letting them take over my uh, podcast and have an at it. A ladies' party. All right, cool. All right, I love everybody. Thanks for checking this. This will be on uh, members only and also Patreon. Patreon.com backslash Freddy Vito. Peace.